we will go, hunting we will go. I own the mill, we owe hunting we will go. All right, we are going to start at a Walgreens and see if they have anything. No, nothing today. And it looks like they just stocked. Just some Pokemon. All right, for those of you keeping score at home, Chronicles Football Fat Packs, or regular packs, whatever the value pack, that's what they are. They had one pack up near the register uh, in the display. All the other stuff had been sold, including the, uh, well, whatever they had. And as you saw back in the uh, toy department, they also had a slot for uh, NBA. They still have spots for fat packs there and hanger boxes. So, and what was up with magic stuff being put into a uh, theft-proof box? That's the other thing, too. So, something happening with magic that we're not aware of. So, food for thought on that. Anyway, let's keep on moving and see what else we can find out there in the wild. Well, on a beautiful cloudy day, it's time to go to Walmart. And let's see if anything's in stock at Wally World, shall we? Nothing here. Looks like it's been pretty well destroyed. So we're going to stop at a Barnes & Noble and see if we can continue our streak of finding product there. We've been having some decent luck lately. So let's give it a run and see if there's anything here. Let us know in the comments if you've been going to Barnes & Noble and checking out product there. We'd love to know if you're able to find anything. What have you been able to pick up? So let's get inside. Amazing. That's it. I know. When, when, did, when did you stock? Um, they came in, I think, last Thursday. Oh, so you still have stuff from last Thursday. Yeah. Wow, I'll take those too. Yep, okay. And yes, I am. All right, good. How about that? Saves about $3 a box on these, I think. Yeah, it does actually. I'm surprised you still had stuff. We got, that's what we got the most of. Yeah, usually that's the case. So when you can stock again then? Whenever it shows up. Yeah, I mean, we don't have any way of knowing which is too bad. Because we get calls about them all the time. Oh, I'm sure you do. Which is nice. You know, they're a fun thing. That's what you're going to do. You did. It saved at least, uh, oh so yeah, it saved lots. Yeah, like well, I couldn't get the video shot before she grabbed the boxes. But Barnes & Noble still had two boxes of Bowman left, mega boxes. So I grabbed them, and I got them for $3 off each box, and I'll tell you how I did that, unless it's already been put in a different video. So, here we go, let's move on. Well, let's make another stop, and we're going to check out this Walgreens. I believe we are going to give this target a quick look at to see uh, if they have anything else. 
in stock or not. So let's stop and check out a Cracker Barrel and see if they have anything here. We didn't get lucky in Springfield, Ohio, so I figured we'll keep checking and see if we can find anything here. Well, there wasn't anything in Cracker Barrel, so to speak. There was a hockey pack there, a little bit of Pokemon, but that was it for today. So, if I don't remember what day they're getting stocked here, so gonna have to check a couple different days. Here we are coming into a Walmart. So we're gonna see if there's anything here today. How are you? Now I'm running behind. I don't need to be out much. So what does that all mean? We're going to have to ask Mr. Shea. Well, once again, we have things that are changing. This particular Walmart was doing a Friday drop, and now starting this week, they have now changed it, they said, to just putting out stock when it comes in. So no longer holding it all till Friday and putting it out. Now they're putting it out as they receive it. So that is going to get interesting and the rules keep changing as we go along. All right, so here we are at Meyer. Now let's see if we can find anything left over from the drop this morning. It all depends on how each location does it differently. Some will let everybody go through round after round, and sometimes they don't. So it really depends on where you are. Do you have any sports cars left over from your drop this morning? If they have any left, they put them out on the oh, shelf. Oh, do they put them on the shelf? Yep. I'll go back and look. Yeah. Okay. Because you do them at six, right? Yep. Yep, they do them at six. Uh-huh. Okay. Nothing here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, well, well, well. Oh. Well, look at that. We got hangers. That's exactly what I came to look for. So. Last year's uh, heritage is still out there, eh? So we took off that pack. Now I'm not saying a limit. Do you see that here? It's all gone. Well, we stumbled upon this Meyer, and as you saw, they still had some uh, top hangers back there, which is actually what I've been looking for for the last few days. I already have blasters. I just wanted to get some hangers. Now these were actually $12.99, so. Myers is looking to be one of the more expensive locations to pick up product right now. Uh, I believe these are still $9.99 if Target's ever going to carry them. And actually Walgreens is actually also $9.99. And those have yellow parallels, so hopefully they will. So, food for thought. At least we found something at a Meyer this week, and I wasn't sure we were going to. Let's move on. And I pull out of the parking lot of Meyer. And look what I find. Speaking of Walgreens. Well, holy smokes, lots of these. That's the biggest display of those I think I've ever seen. So how interesting is that? They had a ton of the uh, Prime Pass. An absolute ton of it. And in talking with the uh, front counter person, she was saying that the um, that's all stock from last week, which would explain why all the uh, tops and everything else is not on the shelf. But they are expecting a truck today, and it hasn't been here yet. It's pretty early. I thought I'd give it a shot because you you, know, you never know. All right, we're gonna keep checking some Walgreens later in the day and see what happens with stockings. I have a feeling, if we get lucky, we may find 
those tops blasters with the yellow parallels. All right, we're gonna pull in the Walgreens and see what's happening here. What is happening here? Ay ay ay. Eye bleach, pull out the eye bleach. Well, if it did get anything or not. So I'm just a bit early, but I did see they were just bringing out some of the truck stuff. And I saw the top Series 2 blasters, so I wanted to grab those. They would let me do that. I may have to come back here and check in a little while and see what else is on the truck this week. But this Series 2 actually comes contains four exclusive 65 Tops Redux insert cards inside. So, not yellow parallels. There's a new one. So let's see what happens. Let's move on and maybe come back in just a little while. Well, I think we're going to wrap up part one here of this particular video. So, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button. That helps the channel a great deal. And make sure you hit the notification bell for sports cards so you know when I upload the newest version after this one because there's some great hits coming out of there. So thanks for stopping by. Happy hunting out there in the wild and we will see you next time. Take care everybody.